Meet Vivian Mayer. This self-portrait is one of the thousands of photographs she took during her lifetime. Mayer worked as a nanny but had a passion for photography. In life, she was a private person, but in death, her photographs made her an art sensation. Born in 1926 in New York City, Mayer spent her early childhood in France but returned to the U.S. just before World War II started. Her earliest known images are of the Schwamsoir Valley in southeast France, which she visited in 1950. In 1951, Mayer moved back to New York City, but eventually settled in Chicago's north suburbs, where she found work as a nanny. It was while living in Chicago that she evolved as a photographer. From the mid-1950s to the 1990s, Mayer took to the streets to photograph the cityscape, public events, and even strangers. Few people knew about her gift, and Mayer didn't seem to seek the limelight. Many of her photographs remained undeveloped for decades, eventually ending up in five rented storage units. In 2007, the storage facility stopped receiving payments, so they sold Mayer's items to an auction house. Most of her personal archive, more than 100,000 negatives, around 3,000 small prints, hundreds of film rolls, 8mm films and audio recordings, was split among three winning bidders. The unique discovery of her work and enigmatic life story propelled Vivian Mayer to international fame, but only after her death in 2009. Her work has been analyzed and praised by both experts and everyday people, continually prompting new questions and speculations as they see more of her images. And so we invite you to see never-before-seen images, see the small details, see Chicago in a new way, see Vivian Mayer, and color.